future NHL hockey player, National Hockey League hockey league player, Yamir Yager, uh, is a boss, great improving... Name. I'm sorry, what? Great name. I'm sorry, what? Great name. Okay, great name. I wasn't sure, I didn't hear Jamir Yager. Jamir Yager. Uh, truly an unbelievable talent and will be in the Hall of Fame soon enough. It just depends on when he retires from the NHL because uh, he's 43 years old, although he looks like he's 53 years mm -hmm. old. Uh, and again, this is what's great about this story that we're about to explain, which is the hashtag Yager selfie story, uh, is hockey players tend to, in general, be uh, badasses with this type of thing. And it's so funny when, like, these circulate the headlines, I always see this kind of tagline with it, like, NHL player proves why hockey players are the most badass athletes in sports. They do the playoff beards for the, for the uh, Stanley Cup playoff chase, and... They party like animals. Michael Schur will tell you that the, the greatest celebration in sports is the Stanley Cup uh, being risen and being skated around and drink all of that stuff, right? Well, Yammer Yager is adding to the legend of hockey players in general uh, because if you remember back when Julian Edelman, New England Patriots defensive uh, uh, wide receiver, wide receiver. defensive anything, uh, wide receiver. An and MVP of Francis Maxwell's fantasy football team. Fact? Well, he's up so there. far, he's up there. He, in 2015, he had 22 points last game. Solid, good Very job, good. Julian. Fantasy Edmund. NFL team, not fantasy uh, world football team. There, uh, and James Harden, both got extorted. Say that with quotes because they didn't really get extorted. But let's look at, have a look at the two pictures that, of course, circulated when uh, through one was on Tinder. Just fucked Edelman, no lie, literally. Uh, and, and that was her Tinder profile picture. That's fucking awesome. Great profile picture. Uh, and the second one was just James Harden getting a selfie with girl American flag. Harden passed out next to her. Um, so, check model uh, over, uh, I'm sorry, who was hooking up with Yamir Yager, tried to do the same thing. Backfired on her. Bad. Because she tried to extort Yamir Yager for $2,000. Yager said, I don't care, and posted the picture himself including uh, a whole, well, well, hey, let's have a look at the picture, which runs into uh, Instagram. So there's the picture, Yager <laughs> passed out, girl with him, and that inspires hashtag Yager selfie. <laughs> with people throwing up the peace sign with their dog, one with their panda stuffed animal. It's so great, because uh, one with a cat, and most importantly, Francis, your favorite, uh, one with Winnie the Pooh. Is that my favorite? I thought that my favorite was undoubtedly that one. Because well, Jaeger, a funny. bottle of Jaeger, bottle of Jaeger, because yeah, it's Jaeger. But this is this is when the internet responds the best way possible and just provides karma in a big to that girl, because that girl, right? No, this. This is what I did. There's an NBA player who, instead of flipping off the refs, <laughs> <laughs> was that his way of in, yeah? Like, so he wouldn't he get. So he wouldn't get. Yeah, that's what it meant. But he didn't want to get like suspended. Okay, well, or I give this to that girl because <laughs> the thing is she. She knew what she was doing, and this is something that happens way too often in our mainstream media. Like that one girl, that I was just like, I looked at that picture of the one girl with Julian Edelman, and I was just like, like that's someone's daughter. Like she's just posting that she just got reeled, and she wants to get attention from that. Like that is just insane to me. And the same thing is in this situation, except she's trying to use it to gain money. And this guy probably could have paid her two thousand dollars. Not going to be much for him if he's a professional NHL player, but he's just like. No, I'm going to provide karma in the form of embarrassing you. And it also transcended further because now she's in hot water with her at the time boyfriend. Mm -hmm. So it's karma with two sides of this. <laughs> Take that. Uh, what's great about that, uh, first of all, the Yager selfie, when I was, I saw, I thought there was like originally like four of them that yeah. were circulating around Instagram and Twitter and all that great stuff. But you click on the hashtag, <laughs> so there's like 400 Instagram posts of it already. Uh, although the ones that, again, again, the Jaeger bottle. That was great. That is very, very creative. Very intelligent. Also, I remember when Jaeger was on the Boston Bruins. Amongst the, I mean, there's only uh, X amount of teams in the NHL. Jaeger seems to have played for 65 teams <laughs> in the NHL, and the KHL, and the and the CHL, and every professional league you could possibly play in. Again, a legend. A but he scored player. was a free shot to Jaeger in the stadiums. No, but in but you're so close because the drinking game that was played at least at school in New England was Jaeger bombs. Ah. Uh. So anytime you score, there was a big siren that would go off at any bar you were at during Bruins games, and they would just uh, do Yager bombs. Same thing happened with me when I used to score at my college. You know Maxwell House coffee? Yeah, they used to just take shots of, like, Maxwell but, coffee but see, Francis, coffee the, best, the, <laughs> the best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup, not Maxwell's in your cup. No, I'm telling you, Jason, I used to, they used to line up by the field, and they'd all just take straight shots of coffee beans and go crazy. It was nuts. It's a very strange, <laughs> strange...
<laughs> Analogy. Yes. That's what happened. Anyway, what's your perspective on this? Do you think this girl got what was coming to her? Yeah, 110%. And that the best part about all of it is that Yager does not give a shit. Yeah. He literally goes and posts the picture himself. Because, sure, I don't care. Well, like, he's he's interacting with a girl, I imagine. He's also single, lady. which is another yeah, big thing. Another it's thing. like, if he was married, this would have probably of worked. Of course. If he was married, then I, maybe that's what she was thinking. But she's in that situation herself. She was with someone, correct, who... A sad story, we don't know the exact details of it, but apparently the person she was with <laughs> looked up to Jagger as a aspiring role model who was a young hockey player it's himself. It's a good player to look up to. And, and I'm just like, good player. all right, well, the girl you're with just cheated on you with the guy that you probably talk about quite a lot and then tried to use that to get money on him and now look at her. Embarrassed. Make good choices, people. Wrap it up. Post your Yager <laughs> selfies with a Photoshop Francis Maxwell in them. Please do. And uh, send them over to at JasonRubin91 and at Francis underscore Maxwell. But more importantly, send them over to at TYT Sports. Don't forget yeah. to subscribe, like, favorite, all the good stuff. We'll see you next time. And if you really do want to just play like Maxwell Bomb, it's great. You just like shots at Maxwell House. <laughs>